Hey everybody, this is two boys, one brain cell, I'm Chuck Beast, and this is Joel Norton, and today we are reacting to We Threw It All Away by Jason Michael Carroll. Yeah. Uh, and I do not know this one. And we're working our way through this album, and uh, thanks to shout out to our Patreon. Absolutely, thank you guys. And uh, yeah, so far it's been not too bad. Oh uh, yeah. Is for torture with the country music. I love it. Keep it coming. Chuck loves it. I do. I'm in the middle ground. It's not been bad, honestly. You just got to keep a smile on this face. We're not worried about this There's face. There's always a smile on your face. <laughs> Fair enough. How dare you be positive? <laughs> How dare you be a positive person? <laughs> you got me, man. All right. <laughs> all right, guys. We're going to jump into this and check her out. Let's we get a threw it all away. I don't know if that was a good spot to stop there, bud. Just, just, just. Good job. If it was bad, my apologies. But we're about the center point mark, so. I was waiting for the baby part to come in. The what part? The baby. I thought you haven't heard this song before. I haven't. How'd you jump with the baby? The lyrics. So you read it before it happened, huh? No. Wow, some Were reaction. you not listening? Some reaction. Wow, button. this Ooh. guy over here. He said, I was waiting for the baby part. He's, here. He's reading ahead, guys. No, I'm not. You're you're a terrible. Fake terrible. reaction. No. Yeah. <laughs> 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 no, the, the lyrics were definitely leading that way. That's all it was. Oh, my. And then I started thinking he was going to wait until, like, the end of the damn song to say it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> No, I'm digging this so far. Yeah, no, it sounds pretty good, honestly. Yeah. Yeah. You want to finish it out? Yeah, I I will say, though, I, I do like his voice. Oh, yeah. How it fits with the... It has, like, a mainstream feel, but it's not too mainstreamy. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's weird. Because his lyrics are a little different. Yeah. And from most of the songs that I have heard from him, he it's almost... He makes it feel like a story. Yeah, I get that. Even if he's not necessarily telling a full story... Which in this, it does definitely tell, seem like he's telling me a story, but he makes everything feel like it. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah. And you're at least getting the stories from parts of it. Yeah. All right. So I just kept on loving you on a day. And we threw it all away. It's funny how life works out sometimes, just like we play.
the whole town had to say. Mama cried, Daddy went for a drive, and the whole world changed. Not a clue what to do, so I just kept on loving you on the day. And we threw it all, God bless the day. I like those guitars at the end there. Oh. Hmm. That's a good sing-along song, too. Yeah, I could see that. All in all, I, I enjoy it. It's just, uh, it's country. <laughs> not, not the, I don't know how to put it. I don't know how to put it at all. I'd probably put this, not to just jump into ratings here. But, like, I'd probably put this at, like, a 5.5. Like, it's enjoyable. Yeah. And it is sing-along-y, but I don't know where I sit with it. So it's going to go in a playlist because I don't know whether I enjoy it a lot or if I'm not sure if it's, like, meh, it's average. Yeah, you're not sure whether it's going to stay there. Yeah, that's a good way to put it. Yeah. I, I For the most part, though, I like the lyrics, though it does have that... Uh, the early 2000s lyrics. The setup? The way that this whole You're setup. Yeah, like it's like, you know. You right there, man? Yes. I, I dropped my brain cell. I was dropping the brain cell. <laughs> um, I don't know. There's a lot of songs that are like singing about uh, like this this kind of uh, content. Lyrically. Oh, you're saying like having a Lyrically, kid. Yeah, yeah. I having think a kid I think and kind of. Normally it's like 2000s country. That I've noticed it a lot in. I can see that. Like Ken, older Kenny Chesney did it a lot. And, you know, like, like, hey, I'm going to pause my life because I'm having a kid. Yeah. Or like you're going through changes because you yeah. had a kid, right? Like, it's, I feel I haven't heard it a whole lot lately, country wise, but obviously yeah. I'm not huge into this. Right. And I haven't really heard it from the 90s country that I've listened to, but I've heard it a lot from 2000s country. And I think oh, yeah. I mean, like, it's, what, a, it's a pretty good staple. And of, I'm not saying it's bad at all. It's a pretty good staple of the genre. I was I was just curious if is is it is it have this kind of content earlier than two thousands a lot or is it more of a common thing in the two thousands? I, late I 2000s? think you pretty much nailed it there. It's, it's, okay. it's more common there. That's I mean, where it, it, it up. does kind of happen in maybe like the late other eras and stuff. stuff. Yeah, but not it as is much, as much it was. more heavy in there. Yeah, kind of like you know the country in the two thousand ten to two thousand fourteen was like. Dirt road solo cups and like they just started listing shit off. You know yeah, what I mean? It was party country. Yeah, yeah. Parking lot party. Party country right there. That was your favorite song, right? No. That album? Yeah, absolutely not. Don't get me started, Joel. He loves Lee Bryce. Uh I do. You just not that song? No, I I like all his that entire album's phenomenal. My yeah. only problem that I ran into is my favorite songs off that album. We're not the ones that were popular. We're not the popular ones. That whole album, those whole albums were good. It was this definitely good. Not at yes. all related to him. <laughs> I no. ju- yeah, stand it, stand it, stand it. <laughs> Lee Bryce right. is the shit, though. I will, I will say that. Yes. We can both agree on that. Yes. But, so what I'm saying, I guess, this has potential because I like the lyrical content. Yes. Because I love that, the way that's set up. However, just not being a country listener. Yep. I want to more, I want to check it out a little bit more. Because yeah. like I, I had a Kenny Kenny Chesney song um, in my so, like playlist since I've met you, yeah, and it's not moved from that list, so it could be one of those, or it could be one that's like yeah, you know, I enjoy it for a time, and yeah, you know, it, it has this period of time in my life, and then it goes, yep, or uh, I get that because just not feeling it too, yeah, so, so it could go any one of those ways. Um, I don't know what I want, guys. I normally <laughs> if a song comes across my playlist three times and I skip it every time. That that's when it goes away. You're like, yeah, yeah, because at that point I realize I just don't. It's not that I'm not in the mood for you, but I just don't care. Now here's my question: Do you have that with songs that you're like, listen, I love this song, but I've heard it too much, so I'm gonna leave it there? Yes. Yeah, I have that a lot too. Yes. That's why I was curious. I'm like, it's a good ass song, so I don't want to lose that song. So I've keep heard it this there. song seven times in the last three days. Yeah. I'm over it. Yeah. So you're like, I'm gonna give. I'll skip it. 
even if it's a couple you know weeks in a row. Yeah. But you know, keep her there just in case. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna go with a seven point four with this one. I really Ooh, enjoyed this. Very nice. And it's definitely going in a playlist. Oh, he just added it. It's it's in the playlist. He just added it. It's already in the playlist <laughs> for me. Yeah. Bam. I enjoyed this. Mainly because I made the playlist. <laughs> Anyway, thanks, Joel. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm sure you could have made the playlist if I wouldn't have made it first. Yeah, it sure could have. Super hard. Yeah, yeah. It's super duper. It's too hard. difficult, man. <laughs> um, but no, all in all, like I said, it, I I just want to see if I warm up to this or I go grow cold to it. Yeah, it can go either way for me. But I did enjoy. There was a few other ones on this album actually that were a little bit lower rated, and then listening to them a second time, third time, I warmed up to it more. Yeah. So. I'm actually getting like quite a bit of that with this guy. There's yeah. been songs I've out like just outright and loved. There was a few last week. Um, yeah, Alyssa lies. Yep. Right. There's some just songs like okay, this is a great song. And there's others that are just taking me a little bit to warm up to. Yeah, I don't think yeah, I, I don't think he's had a. You've gotten a bad review for him. No, I haven't. You've just you've gotten the average. The worst, still a little above. I think the then, worst song on this album so far is the first one on the on the thing. Yeah. Where's I like, talking about the uh, bar fight? It was just kind of a little cheesy and a little over the top. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah, I follow. And that one kind of grew a little cold for me. Yeah. Listen to it a second time. But the rest of them, I think they've gone up. Yeah. So, I mean, one song so far. I mean, his voice alone. Yeah, his voice is, is great. Yeah. Hell yeah. Yep. That's all I got. So, shout out to our Patreon. Woo. We appreciate you. Yeah, we do. And, uh, you know, even if it's not my cup of tea, I do enjoy, I enjoy that uh, getting me out of my... My box. Yep. Check out some something different, right? We got that country going for that. This is supposed to be like a musical musical exploration, right? Yep. And then we got and then we're just we got that heavier about, rock that's getting me in there. And then yeah, and then we're just honest about how we feel about it. And then uh, you either warm up to it or you don't, and you just you find your find your way, right? Yep, hundred percent. But uh, yeah, we appreciate the request. And uh, if you guys enjoyed our reaction slash review, do us a favor, hit the like and subscribe. Come, come join our little music community. If you have any requests, drop those down in the comments down below. Until next time, guys. Peace. Peace.